Hey everybody, it's Seth Jones, Editor-in-Chief of Golfdom Magazine. I'm out here in Jersey City, New Jersey. I'm at Liberty National Golf Club. It's the 2017 President's Cup. And you know, talk about an international competition. I'm here with Mr. International, Mike O'Keefe from The Ohio State University. He is the uh, director of the intern program out there. Uh, and Mike, you know, I see you at a lot of these events, but and you usually have a good contingent of, of kids with you. This one's a little bit different, not just because it's an international event, but also because you guys are really lent a hand out here. Can you talk to me about um, the circumstances this week? Absolutely. Well, uh, Greg James uh, is a great guy, and Jesse Dowdy, uh, they came to me a long time ago and said, hey, we want to, this is an international event, we want to make it international, not just from the golf side, but from the maintenance side as well. So I worked with him, and we've got uh, Three great guys here as interns, um, Gavin Keyword is from England, uh, Brad Foster is from Australia and Billy Koopmans is from Australia. But when it came time to getting this all together with volunteers, um, Greg had uh, a number of key guys down in Florida ready to come up and they couldn't come up because of the hurricane. So he called me up and he said, look, it's late notice, can you get me anybody else? And I said, absolutely. I dropped the hammer and got a bunch of guys up. I think we've got a total of 18, including the guys as volunteers, and they're from six different countries. And you know, this is difficult for somebody like Greg. You don't know if the weather's going to change. You want to have the guys on, on board. And I, I like helping guys like Greg out. He's a good guy. He's a great Penn State guy. But it's nothing wrong with having Ohio State guys helping out when the when the, uh, in a pinch, you know. That's right. That's right. And now, for you guys, I can just imagine. You know, the, our industry is different. But when I interned, I interned not too far from here, and I lived in a hotel for two weeks. These guys are interning, and they're coming out here, and they're seeing Liberty National every day, or, or the other courses you've, that you've helped place guys around the country. To me, that sounds like an awesome time. But it's also a valuable experience. Talk, we were talking a little bit off camera about you know just the networking in this industry. What what do you tell the guys, the, the, the guys that come through your program, about why this is important for them to see the not not just the local courses, but to see the it's global. It's critical. Tournament preparation, the logistics that's involved, the camaraderie. I mean, here in the States, they set a model. These guys work as a team, and I want those young guys from Australia, from Ireland, from England, from Scotland, to see what a team Greg has. And that's what builds a great industry and a great profession. That what makes you a better professional. Later, when you go back home, you're not insulated. You call your mate down the road and say, hey, we're having problems. And that that's what I see is that networking is critical for my guys. Guys especially because they they there I see them sitting around the breakfast place the French guys talking to the English guys they're comparing notes and saying did you see how they're managing those greens they're hand rolling the greens like that was a surprise for them they got barrels of water and they're rolling them and they were like why are they doing that I thought they had these expensive rollers but sometimes you got to go back to basics when you don't want to stress out your greens you get the hand rollers out and you do it gender. that's what I'm talking about you pick up ideas every time and these kids that are out at Glen Oaks and they come here to volunteer you know the guys come up from congressional you know they're here they're seeing a different way of doing the same things and everybody's different Greg's Greg's got his own way of doing things you know so that's great Mike, Mike I'll ask you this just an opinion question you've been out here I know you've been working on the crew um, you know it's amazing to me that this used to be a, a, a dump literally what do you think about the way the course is looking what, what have you noticed about the the conditions that Craig and his team has got it in right now you know he's got this an awesome condition and I mean he's had a tough summer it's been wet it's been dry I mean to consider what he's got gone through this summer it's an amazing condition and they're trying to keep it you know in pristine condition for the players they're listening to the PGA Paul Vermeulen is in what do they want you know Nikki Price wants one thing you know the, the American captain wants something else so but they're, they're trying to keep the place looking pristine and that's the key sadly today it's all about the TV audience there's one billion people gonna be watching this so they want this place to look good on TV and they're trying to nurse it through so I love the way he's got the place set up um, clearly for an event like this this is gonna be about birdies this is gonna be about entertainment they're gonna they want the greens fast the players want the firm and fast and that's what he's delivering he's giving them what they want Great. Mike, we got less than a billion people watching this, but it, was still, it still looks good. So I appreciate you taking the time. Always good to see you out here on the course. Absolutely, and we appreciate you coming out and getting the stories. And uh, there's a lot of good stuff going on this week, and hopefully we'll get the, a good good event and we get the international to give a good uh, good good result. You know. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. All right, guys. This is Mike O'Keefe. He's out at Ohio State University. I'm Seth Jones. We're out at the President's Cup. Thanks for watching Golf Team TV.